In this episode, we drive five hours north of Brisbane to fish out from Bundaberg. The region is known as the rum capital of Australia, and its famous Bundy rum is enjoyed by countries all around the world. It's also a popular fishing destination, and this trip we would head wider Bundy to fish the very southern end of the Great Barrier Reef between Lady Elliot Island and the Break Sea Spit. This large expanse of water holds various types of reef systems, with my favourite being the tiny isolated rocks no larger than a small car. Due to the size of these rocks, they're extremely hard to find, which means they're less likely to be found by other fishermen and will often produce the better quality fish. In the past, we've caught red emperor over 18 kg, along with massive largemouth nanny guy, reef jacks, snapper, and big grass sweet lip. The downside of these small rocks is the fish move around a lot. If the bait isn't there, then the fish won't be either. So the area can be very hit and miss, as we're about to find out. Fish. Are you a bit nervous? <laughs> well, I won't be one. Big mallet. <laughs> Red. Red? Yeah. Well done, mate. Yes, Benny. Woo! You'll be OT. Work, mate. First fish. Yeah. Schoolie. Yep. Nice work, Benny. Start the trip, mate. Nice little school fish. What would he be about? Probably six. Something like that. Yeah, something like that. Good work, mate. Got to be happy when we've been looking at a few spots and it's dead quiet. And you start getting a little bit worried. It's good to get the first one in the boat, Benny. Get the monkey off the back. Said, kick that monkey away now, that mate. That was awesome, mate. He's actually starting to get a bit of Good black lip is going on him too. Look at that. Early on. There he feeds. That beautiful pattern on his face. Beauty. What bait was that on, mate? It was a bit of a uh, cocktail, mate. A bit of squid, a bit of mullet. Nice. We'll take it. Good work, mate. That's awesome. Brain spiked. So we're just fishing a really small rock, wider Bundy at the moment. And we've just got a three-way hooker. Dad's done his. What do you got here, mate? Cod, cod, cod. Bugger. Yep. Oh, bugger. Yep. Oh, bugger. Yep. Oh, bugger. Gold spot spot. Good fish, Benny. You reckon? <laughs> just, just came away from a bit of the reef. Little tiny rocks, no bigger than a metre half, two metres high. And uh, we've all hooked up. Dad pulled the hooks on his. I got hit, pulled the hooks, but he came back and grabbed it again. Benny's got that big gold spot cod. I don't know what I've got. Probably something similar. We'll wait and see. Just gone to a more of a floating style setup. This one, it's 30 pound mono, seven foot venom rod, just a nice bit of length to it. Small sinker, a couple smaller hooks, and um, put a pilchard on. Oh, it's a big Maui. Have a go, oh, Maui. You said you'd get. I, I told you I'd get a big one here. Hooked him in the side of the face. That's why. I thought it was curious. Look at that for a platinum snapper. <laughs> That's a cracker. I've only just got him, mate. Sort of the face. Terry doesn't feel so bad for pulling the hooks now. <laughs> no. That's what they would have been. <laughs> 
Oh, how's that for a big platinum snapper? Big slady grin. Mother-in-law fish, black all. They go a lot of different names. Not, not the desired species we need though. But these areas have got a lot of them. We did mention the boys will probably get a couple in these areas. They certainly have. They go bloody hard too. He had his own remora on him, that's how big he is. Don't get in the rod, Arden. Get these hooks out. Letting out. Pies here, bud. Right. There you go. You can go back. Yep. No Benny. Nice fish. I'd love the, I'd love the uh, squid. Yeah, mate. Another big coddy. Like a crayon the same size. Oh dear. slow with persevering, rock hopping, just doing a few more drifts than I normally would over spots. I think there could be fish there that we're just not catching. It's fishing a little bit lighter still. Hooked up to a fish, doesn't feel too bad. Had a bit of a bad run with vermin, cod and slaty brim. It's um, been nice for changes for us. What you're saying is you're due. We are due. Yeah. Yeah, right, Benny. Spangled, I reckon. Spango. Yellow. Oh, wow. Is such a thing as a good Spango? Yeah. Now, vermin run continues. It's a uh, big Spangled Emperor. Oh, hold him up for a no, I'll hold get, just get Benny to hold this up. <laughs> Go, nice big spangled emperor. Beautiful coloration with those blue dots through the scales. Not a very uh, nice fish to eat, but if you eat them fresh, they're not too big, they're, they're okay. But we call them leather boots because when you get them big like they do get a bit tough. So he'll go back and live another day. Beautiful. There he goes. Guys, there it is. Nice flipper. Not a bad one, too. Yeah. Nice red throw. Nice little red track. Nice, nice colour, huh? Yeah, beautiful. Dark colour, isn't he? Give a good account for ourselves. Yeah, that beautiful little coral cod. One of the prettiest fish in the ocean, beautiful blue dots. Got him on a Zurich Flash Wrigley. Catch all sorts of fish. Beautiful eating. Pure white flesh in these guys. Nice fish. Nice grassy Benny. Another species. Beautiful, beautiful blue under the eye. Top eating. Right up there, this one. Let's see what the old boys okay. what, are you, what are you getting over here? Oh yeah? What do you feel like, mate? It feels like the end of the day, <laughs> hopefully <laughs> bringing up a red on a tough day. What's Pop got? A little hustle. A head red conversion. Yeah. I'd hate to see oh, colour. I was going to say, I'd hate to see the spangled come up about now. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I think that's what it is. It sure is. The spango. Oh dear. Benny. 
<laughs> like you said, it a is. tough day. It's a tough day, it's just continued on. Oh dear. It's really been a vermin day. Wow. Good one, Bill. What a bugger. <laughs> the next morning I opted to fish a new area with larger reef systems in hope of catching a range of reef species to improve our trip before heading out to the shelf to fish the deeper water. Big, big tough. Big Venus tough. Yeah. Big Venus tusk fish. It's a nice size one, that one. Beautiful coloration. Nice pale green. Pretty hard, too. Gotta be a red. Gotta be a red. It has to be a red amongst all that, Jesus. Nice head shakes to him. Oh. Big grassy, maybe. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> just have a nice little small red. That was legal. Any red is a good red. This touch? A moment of truth, Benny. Oh, I think I like the look of it. That's a big carrot. Here it's it comes. Yeah, it's, a it's, a it's a red. Is it? Yep. Let me get that net. Yeah. Any size? Oh, just a nice legal one. Right. Then you went off then. Work, Benny! Woo! Yeah! Bit of a wall. Nice schoolie. Bit of wall between reds. About this time yesterday morning. <laughs> <laughs> Better get them while they're in. Nice work. Something beautiful on them. Good one. Wait, wait. Work, mate. Oh, I reckon it'd be a red, mate. Yep. Not a big one. It's not even legal. Not quite legal. Just up? Nah. Not it's legal. under. Oh, yeah. Yes. Red green. Yep. Yeah. Legal one? Yeah. The beauty. Nice girl size red. Just white a bunny. We're really struggling on the small rocks where we've caught really good fish before. It's uh, the little tiny rocks that are no bigger than a car. Just don't have the bait and they're not holding the fish at the moment. So it comes some more reefy country with live bottom. We're just doing big long drifts through that reefy country. We're starting to pick up a few fish now. It's, um, nice, nice eating size anyway. No massive fish, but if you want to get one that you want to eat, that's the size you want. We'll keep chipping away today and uh, hopefully turn the box into something respectable. So how we go. We're dead? Yep. We're dead. One, two, eh? Alright. Yeah, it feels um, rather big. Did he? Yep. Oh. Uh, 
Beautiful. Grassy sweetly. Gorgeous fish. Look at that blue lines. Magic. Nice red down in the front. Top eating, white flesh. That's awesome. Looking at the ground, we see there'd have to be some grass sweet loop here. And got a few reds first, but now that. New beauty. Oh, a little green jump. Oh, really? Yeah. Jeez. Oh, jeez. for a little green jobby. Far out. That's the smallest one I've ever seen by a long shot. Crazy. <laughs> look at the head on Even started to look mean even at that young age. It's cool. After catching a good mixed bag of reef species, we headed out wide and sound around in the deep water. Eventually I found this nice shell fish in 200 plus metres of water, and just seconds after the baits hit the bottom, we hooked some good fish. Up, it? What do we got here, Benny? It's big. Got a lot of bubbles. A lot of shark. Barry, eh? Yep. There you go, Benny. Your first Barry. Very good, Benny. Your first bark off? Yeah, mate. First one. Uh, it's a good size, not too big. Should feed the kids this week. That's it. Feed them that eye, mate. Yeah. <laughs> 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 no one surprised me, Benny. Let's make a red. Good rock with them, I think. You're making 780. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Yeah. You'll be your too, it's a cracker too. Oh good. It's a different type. Yeah, it's a different type, that one. Oh yeah, he's a good one. Look at that. Yeah, Benny! Good on you, Benny. Yeah! Well, I didn't do too much, mate, I've just had it there. Yeah, man. Right, mate. Beautiful fish. She bit like one. Yeah, didn't it? Set it straight away. Yeah. And that'll be old mate that come back after. Yeah. He's a good eating size. Short stumpy with them one. Yeah. Yeah, he's an eight oh, bar. He's a bark one, No, eight bar. Different type. Right. Yeah. How do you tell that mate? Oh the tail's different. He's just got a slightly different body shape as well. Yeah right. Just and he will have eight bars. Get me a bar of charm what's popping. Work, Benny? We'll throw him straight in. Look at that. What do you want to have a three-way hold up? Yeah we'll Oh, they're beautiful, eh? Look at that. Oh, they're so good. Very cool fish. Yep. Sorry. Same type. Yeah, okay, yeah. They're a bit, they're a bit shorter, a bit stumpier. Yeah. What did he take, mate? Uh, that one was... I just pulled off a fresh squid head. Oh, yeah? Oh, okay. And I did put a little teaser to it, I think. A little bit of husser or something. Good, yeah, good. good work, Benny. Look at that. Beauty, mate. Look at that beast. So good. How good's that tail? That one is so good. Yeah. Look at the scarlet on the side. Yeah, yeah it's beautiful. Fantastic. In the Rolling back this way. Head back my way. Yeah. Oh, that's so good. Flappity flap. First bar and our first flamey for you, mate. That's it, mate. You beauty. Tick in the box. Oh, they're nice looking fish, that colour. Beautiful, aren't they? So good. Got a high Hold fin up. standing up on them. Yeah. Cod. Cod. Mm. Eight bar. Two on. Two of them. Flamey as well. Oh, flamey at the bottom. Oh. Or is it a um, something else? Oh, <laughs> Good work, old boy. Yeah, thanks, Greg. Putting us on the spot again. Beautiful. It's a pretty fish, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. That's different, eh? That's cool. Real soft mouth, too.
Yeah. Yeah, it's nearly ripped through. Yeah, big hole in it. Nice work. The flamey pop. Oh, you'll be easy. See the long flame. Yeah, the the right. Right. Look at it. It is? Yep, see the red. Nice one. Just at 215 metres of water. Fishing wide of Bundy and we've sort of come back down a little bit. That really north, northwest point of the Breaksea Spit. Had a bit of a look around, haven't found a great deal, but we've just found a patch of these guys. And some cod as well. Beautiful yeah, colours. Nice. <laughs> so good. Yeah. What you got here, old boy? Yeah, not big, is and it? your fish. <laughs> Could be anything. Good answer. How about you, Benny? What you got? Well, I think the way he bit it, I think I'm going to go a flaming. Good work. That's yeah, it. Bit of confidence. Bit of confidence. What do we got here? Fifteen to go. What do we got down there? See something? Yeah, you see red. What do we got? Talk to me. What do we got? Yeah, it's another, looks like another comet, comet roper. Yep. Sure is. They are all the tail ones. Yeah, it's it. <laughs> ring, ring growths on a tree, you might be able to tell its age. <laughs> Man of bark. Old comet. Beautiful. I'll get this one, mate. You got it, mate? Yeah. Let me know when you need a break, mate. You get puffed or anything, sore arms, the wine. <laughs> yeah, I see that before. You see the front foot. Yeah. Nice pearl. Look at that. That's a nice Oh, he's about to tear out. Oh, yeah. Nice work, Benny. You. How good's that in the shade? Yeah. That'll be doing your head in. Are you going every mate? No, yeah, nothing yet. Well, yeah. maybe then. Would look like it. Oh yeah. Load her up. Come on. Oh yeah, it's a better one. <laughs> oh, another one. Not the plastic you're leaving. Jesus. Nice. I didn't want to leave it too long for a shark. Nah, that's right. Big pearly thing. Oh, the oh, shark got it. What the sun? <laughs> go, go, go. Oh, come on. Oh, he, he hit it again. Did he? Yeah. Yep. Shark hitting it. Yeah, shark hitting it. Go fast, fast, fast. <laughs> Here come the mine. Yeah. Oh no. Oh, no. How'd you go? Nice oh, he's been smashed. <laughs> Has he? Yeah. He's not. He eaten. got hit. <laughs> he's still attacked. That's a good pearl. He'd be oh, he's lucky. Teeth marks all over him. <laughs> <laughs> he's had to get away with the Oh, it's two crackers. Oh, yes. Look, Look at the size, size of that it. That second one. On the plastic. I told you. Oh, plastic. what you going to lose these fish? You all right? Got him? You might be all right. Going good on rod and reel. Hey, the big one. Yep, bud. Oh, yeah. Oh, you got a double one out. Oh, I've got some wine out, please, mate. Good fishing. This watch doesn't do a big freeze bill. Look at that. <laughs> you. Yeah, that's bigger than your last one, mate. Beautiful. Look at that. that better. On the Zurich flat shad. Beautiful. Double yeah. binned. 
Double pinned him. Got a bucket mouth. How's it going, those big bucket mouths? Probably uh, nearly 70 odd centimetres, getting close to 4.5, 5 kg. We're at 150 at the moment. They are horses, Benny. Crackers, aren't they? We said, let's come in and just get a few pearlies before we have to head off in them. Chase a few reds maybe a bit later, but a few more of them would be nice. I reckon. They're horses. Have a go at them. This one here's been hit by a shark on the way up. Teeth, teeth marks all over him. Very lucky. What they're doing over the track in the shark, yeah. Right? yeah no. See how long until we get shark, huh? Having a problem with sharks nailing our pearlies on the way up at the moment. We're losing quite a few fish, they're biting the rigs, so. Wait and see what. I... Oh, there you go, just got hit. How's yours? Oh, there it goes. Yep, just got hit and done it. This one's about to get hit. Not far to go, mate. Oh, snapper. snapper. Tommy. <laughs> Old snapper, right? That's why the shark didn't grab him. Okay? Didn't they get shark? No. No, it looked like it was, but maybe it's just a snapper. I reckon. Bouncing. Probably had one on this, maybe. Or, yeah, could have just been a knobby. Nice work, mate. Nice oh, work. Oh, snaps. Snaps. Huh? Left green. Yeah, not much left of that one. <laughs> Let's just make up another rig. Benny's got a snapper. Don't come to up north to catch these though, do no. we? No. With the day getting on, we started to make our way in, but first stopping off at one more spot in 50 metres of water which had plenty of life on it. Huge, but, um, going back to that rock. That's good. There we go, nice snapper. Pick that one up off the bottom, pat an oster rig with a uh, fairly large tiger squid. Just uh, said to Ben that we get a lot of snap around the bottom on these small isolated little rocks, and that's exactly what happened. Instead of getting a red, we've got a snapper. If we go back and get a red. Terry's hooked up a nice fish. On sunset. Right. What's your call there, Terry? Yeah. Looks the right colour. Right colour sunset. <laughs> Beautiful head shakes. Tell me it's red. Just one more red to finish the trip off before we head in. That'd be nice. Bit of colour. What have you got? Please lose your silver. Oh, it looks the right oh, colour. It red. looks the right colour. Good work. Beautiful. Oh, just lift off the plate. Yep. Yes, I knew they were there, sitting on that rock. That's beautiful. Sunset red, and it's just about torn it out of how close that is. Good work, old boy. Hey, you doing right now? I think that'll be the last, well, we might have to go for another one, maybe. But... Yeah, three-way hook up to end. <laughs> it's been a tough trip. Yesterday was absolutely shit-ass, wasn't it? It was tough, it was probably the toughest fish we've ever had. 
Today was a go to plan B. It's paid off. Chase some deep water fish, some shallow water fish, mix it up a bit. We've got a good box of fish now. Makes a trip, we've done a hell of a lot of Ks. We've got nearly 100 Ks back home. I think we've done close to 300 odd Ks already, so. Good work, old boy? Yeah. Eh? Hey? You're still right slaying them, aren't you? All these years later. Wouldn't know you're 77. Man. <laughs> I still like me. Fishing. Good on you. That's awesome. <laughs>